The three latest victims of the new SARS-like respiratory virus died in a hospital in Saudi Arabia's capital. Health ministers say they ranged in age from 24 to 60 and had been hospitalized for a month with chronic diseases including kidney failure. At least 30 people worldwide have died from the infection called MERS for Middle East Respiratory Syndrome. Dozens more have become sick. Officials from the Centers for Disease Control in Atlanta say so far there have been no reports of MERS infecting anyone in the U.S. But experts from the World Health Organization say the virus is a threat to the entire globe. We understand too little, too little about this virus. World Health authorities say the first cases of the new virus were found in the Middle East early last year. It belongs to the same family as SARS and has killed about half the people who became ill. It causes uh, flu-like symptoms, so cough, uh, severe fever. Experts say it seems likely the new virus can be passed between people, but only after close and continued contact. They believe it may have originated in bats or camels. The majority of cases have come from Middle Eastern countries, but the virus has spread to Britain, Germany, and France, too. A man died at a hospital in northern France earlier this week after traveling to Dubai. Tina Krause, CBS News.